place that I think we can all agree that playing wreck with randoms can be a little stressful at times. There, I mean, there's some people that refuse and will flat out not go in and, and play with randoms at all. They've always got their five squad, whatever. But, you know, me, working man, got a family, got a full-time job, all that good stuff. Don't always have time to do that. So this weekend, while there was some double rep in the wreck, I decided to take my Larry Bird build, go in there, have some fun. And sometimes, you know, you just got to backpack it and carry them randoms to a win. So let's get right into this video. What's good everybody, it's your boy JD back with what could be one of my last videos of NBA 2K23. We're about a month or so from NBA 2K24 drop in and I suspect the news will start coming in fast and furious here over the next few weeks. So we'll be trying to bring that to you as we get some more rele re relevant news. But uh, yesterday and over the weekend was double rep in the wreck so I decided to take my hick from the French Lick build. You guys know the vibes, my Larry Legend build. I showed you guys the the video earlier playing on the 1v1 court probably one of my favorite builds that I have in NBA 2k23 honestly the 6 foot 9 92 3 ball you know still got good defense can move shoot do all that fun stuff still got contact dunks on this build um, but anyway we were in there playing the wreck and you know I was just playing with some randoms trying to hit level 30 I was about a level away or so so I figured we'd play a couple games and one of the games got a little interesting we had a couple of teammates quit out and that's when Larry Legend went to work so Let's get into the gameplay here. We'll talk a little NBA 2K23, sprinkle a little NBA 2K24, and then I'll show you what probably is the best reward that I've got so far in NBA 2K23 at the end of the video. So let's get right into it. All right, so like I said, this one started out, you know, just like any normal game. Um, this was actually, I think, the game right before my wrap up. Uh, I was just trying to get to level 30, like I said. Oh, you see Larry getting a little no bar contact dunk there. That's why I said this is probably one of my favorite builds. I hope I can make a build similar to this in NBA 2K24. I'd be very happy. Um, you know, with this build 6'9", like I said, 92 three ball, 86 drive and dunk. Still got good defense and everything. But uh, one thing I do when I come in here with the randos, you know, sometimes I don't necessarily want to take the ball and, and make take control early. I mean, I usually try to throw them a few bones just to show them that I'm willing to pass. And I think that really opens up the rest of the game sometimes. You know, you can get caught where you try to do a little too much early on and then you don't see the ball the rest of the game or whatever, but you can see me throwing a, a few quick dots here, the teammates, and, and this one was pretty close, like I said, for from majority of the, the first half and even through the third quarters, you see Larry spotting up there green. That's why I said I love this build. Um, my hit from the French Lick build, you've seen it in the, in the, the 1v1 court in some previous videos that I've done with it. Um, you know, you can do a little bit of everything, like I said. Um, but you see me hitting a little, little pull up midi, even green. Um, you know, the th thing with randoms, like I said, you, you can come in here and still have some fun. I mean, you just gotta temper your expectations is kind of the biggest thing with it. Um, going in with a mindset that you're gonna see some, some dumb stuff, <laughs> don't get me wrong, but uh, you know, you just gotta be ready to chill and, and do your thing. And um, sometimes, you know, you just, you gotta take over a game. And as you see here, we down by 14 points, you know, earlier in the fourth quarter. and. It was just me and one other guy left as, as three of our teammates were gone, and I don't know what, what this guy was doing on defense, but he gave me a couple of quick buckets, and I was actually in the, the chat with the other guy that was left. I'm like, I said, just give me the ball. If you're open, I'll find you, but you know, we'll, we'll, we'll exploit the, uh, the non-defender here. You see Larry hitting a little fader to the corner. Um, you know, and the comeback was on. The rest of the, the rest of his team was, was still trying to play defense and everything, and uh, you know, Listen, I don't do anything flashy. I ain't gonna dribble like Steezo. Um, you know, I ain't gonna, you ain't gonna spread the floor and, and run a five out like Joe knows or, or anything like that. You know, I play pretty basic, pretty basic 2K for for the most part. I don't do too much flashy. But even playing with the randoms, if you just come in here and, and use some basic IQ, um, you know, granted there there's sometimes you just get with a group of randoms that you just have no control over what you do but as you can see we we uh, come all the way back here we've taken a lead by five points now uh you boys got 37 points you know still got four assists got, got four rebounds get about to get a fifth one here you see we we snag right before the game is over and we're just trying to dribble out the clock i was trying to ld and just hold on to it here and then you know my dumbass decided to run into the guy and give the ball up but uh thankfully there wasn't enough time left on the clock for them to uh finish that but you see we made the comeback down 14 in the fourth quarter come back and win so you know that was definitely a little bit of fun you know i hit my level 30 went to get my mascot i'll show you what mascot i got here in just a second uh, probably one of my favorite 2k rewards of nba 2k 23 but like i said you just gotta temper your expectations when you go in with the randoms and enjoy yourself and 
you know that's what I did here but uh so like I said we hit level 30 and got our mascot and that's right your boy being a huge Milwaukee Bucks fan got his Bango Milwaukee Bucks mascot uh, I don't know how 2k chooses these at random or whatever but your boy got his Bucks mascot I'm very happy I know what I'll be rocking for the last month or so of NBA 2k23 if you see me around in the park so that's really all I got for this video I appreciate you sticking around stay tuned for some NBA 2k24 news coming soon uh, if you guys want to see anything else on the channel let me know down below but don't forget to like the video subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in the next one I'm out Peace.